What is going on, guys? Welcome back. Commentary for you. I'm amazed. I got a positive Madden play. My computer didn't delete it. And my email didn't reject it. And here we are. Now, I will also say this is a Colts fan. You can see he broke out the blue pants. So I like the throwbacks here. But this is a botch snap in Madden. And I really like this. I'd like this more if there was some context to it. Like, just put the center in the game. Just put the quarterback in the game. But... Defensive reactions, pretty good. Quarterback could have reacted a lot better, but that could be user control. Other than that, Miles Garrett picks it up, goes in for a touchdown. Miles Garrett's reaction could have been a little different. He's running real angled here, but at the same time, goes right back to where the ball is. Linemen honestly look like they're confused and don't know how to block. Now, traditionally, this happens in Madden, but we don't see this result. You know, the fact of the matter is I cover a lot of Madden on my channel, and a lot of my commentary comes from clips that you guys send me. It takes a long time. For someone to send me a positive play because we don't normally see this from Madden. I think that's the biggest takeaway. If somebody could send me a positive play every single day, I could have positive dialogue every single day. But instead, you know, I get what Madden shows you guys. The ball orbits the player 17 times before it gets caught by his shoe. Madden has the pieces in place to be a good football game. The problem is we see it so infrequently that when it's finally shown in a way we're amazed by it, we feel taken back. Where is this realism 99% of the time? Not that every snap should be botched, but at the same time, I've not seen this in my game in a very long time. Solid and all-pro football. Hate to bring up the contrast, but love to know your guys' thoughts on this. Appreciate you checking it out. I will be back in the week with more commentary.